Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Now in this video, I'm going to tell you exactly why you should stop spending your money, your ads budget in exact match campaigns right away. Now let me quickly dive into our uh, audit that we did. Now the, the audit that you are going to see, this is just the 10% of it, just the analysis of the targeting type, how much they're spending and 90% uh, of which we are not showing. We will probably try to show the exact steps, how we do an audit of an account. So let me just uh, quickly dive into the video here without wasting any further time. So if you don't know me, my name is Sammy Akhtar. I'm the founder of Regrow Media. We are an Amazon advertising agency where we help brands boost their conversion rate and increase their sales. We are a 35 plus member team managing over 60 plus brands, managing over 150 million USD in clients revenue. So if you just see here, this is a report that we have prepared for the audit for the client. Here you can see, uh, if I just show you the maximum percentage of sales, 48% of sales is coming from exact match campaigns, which is around 23%. If you just check, uh, the exact match campaign is taking 23% of the sales share, whereas 27% of the spent share as well. If you look at the other distribution of sales, it is not so great because maximum spend is allocated towards exact match. I know you tell exact matches for ranking, but you need to allocate your budget towards broad and phrase because that contributes towards ranking, but also they will give more A cost, a cost focused results. If you're looking to get lower A cost, you need to focus your shift from exact to broad and phrase because exact match, it will give high A cost for you for sure. Now, if you look at this particular uh, account here, you can see exact match. It is spending so much in exact match, whereas AA sign targeting, obviously, you know, exact match, EA sign targeting, it has close to zero, uh, zero contribution towards any ranking juice or ranking boost for your product. So here you can see the uh, same as sponsored display campaigns as well, or sponsored video campaigns as well, because they have zero contribution towards your ranking. Uh, here you can see the broad and phrase distribution as well. If I just show you broad uh, sales around 10%. Here you can see also see if you just come down below the broad, the sales share is around 22%. And the spent share is around 18.72% uh, of the total sales that uh, they are getting. Total sales by total sales. I mean, this is the PPC report. This is the total report. I mean, the total account, how much they are doing, right? So here you can see all this data for this account as well. Uh, sum of total uh, orders, sum of total sales, and total limits to a sum of A cost as well, right? Now this is not what I wanted to share you because you can also see in this data, data as well. If I just remove the filter, uh, how much the auto match is targeting on, how much the sponsored clicks, uh, so SD clicks or sponsored display uh, is is uh, contributing towards it. And sponsored display conversions because they are not focusing a lot in impression generated campaigns. And if you know impression, impression the campaigns in sponsored display, which is focus on impressions, they get more placements, more ad placement than any other ad types. Sometimes uh, it may show in the home page itself, even when some customer goes in the home page, it can see their ad even without searching any, any keyword, they can click on the ad and it can give you impressions and it can also show you in the outside Amazon placements as well, outside Amazon search placements as well. So they are not focusing so much on the impression targeting or focusing on the impression type sponsored display ads and look focusing a lot in conversions, which is also seen here. Uh, the conversion rate, the conversion rate obviously depends on category wise, how, which product they are selling, how much they are selling and uh, what is the price range, whether they are premium or not. So obviously the conversion rate is low for them. Uh, they need to improve a lot in conversion rate because on a category level, when we check the SQP data, search query performance data, uh, which we are going to, tr we are trying to showcase you as well, how you can uh, curate a better report out of the search query performance. If they show you the phrase match, obviously phrase match uh, and broad match behaves really good. And we also seen sometimes that broad match can give you good ACOS. Uh, even apart from phrase match, I mean, better than phrase match, which may look a little bit confusing for sellers who are selling for a longer time because now Amazon is also uh, doing a lot of testing with their match types as well. So this is how about the phrase match. Now, if I just come below, uh, you can see the A cost of the match types. So obviously, exact match will give higher A cost that is uh, well justified, right? 
And if you just see the exact my sales, they are bringing huge sales, but obviously the A cost and TAC cost for exact match will be very, very high. And that is also obviously not giving so much ranking juice because they are obviously focusing in high search volume keywords for which ranking is very tough for them, right? So instead of uh, focusing so much in uh, uh, the exact high search volume keywords, they should focus on other derivatives of it, maybe more long-term version of it, right? Now, if I just show you the uh, ASN level distribution, obviously we have changed the ASN so that uh, the client's product is not disclosed. If you just see here the main metrics like TACOS, ACOS, and also we have shorted by uh, the ACOS as well. There are some campaigns which are spending the top 10 uh, SKUs or top 20 SKUs of them. You can see the spend, there's a huge optimization that, that needs to be done because the TACOS for them is also very high in few of the campaigns you can see. So, uh, the here you can see the sales ppc sales and the total sales right obviously the tacos will be high if the ppc sale and the on or, or, or total sales have a huge difference and that is what we are seeing here because you can see the ppc sales is much closer to the uh, total sales and that is why the tacos is so high so obviously uh, as you know ppc works completely on a co co contribution and a combination of seo then creatives how well they are performing as well so constant optimization of SEO plus the creatives also needs to be done, whether they're using premium plus content, whether they have videos or not, how many videos they have, whether they have how to use videos, whether to have a uh, good brand story or not. Right. So here, obviously, we can see there are some good uh, products as well, which are spending. And, and uh, let me just see why spend. You can see uh, they're spending high, but the tacos is also high. So obviously, for those where the tacos are high, we need to perform some optimization at the product PDP level as well, product detail page level as well, right? Because you can see the A cost uh, uh, here, the A cost is 48%, which is uh, really high. And the TACOS is 28%. Obviously, their PPC spend is 62,000 rupees in that uh, particular product. And this is just the last 30 days data. So obviously, that is high. We need to perform a huge optimization on that. And by optimization, we don't need to we don't mean just to optimize on bids level uh, by optimization. I have put another video last day where you can see how uh, how much day parting can influence your bidding, your uh, overall sales and a cost contribution as well. Whereas uh, negation and uh, placement optimization also plays a very important role. Some of the accounts are also getting rest of the search optimization, which we previously used to trick the Amazon algorithm. But now uh, Amazon is uh, giving us the opportunity as, as well as Amazon is giving us the opportunity to day part or make your bid increase on a specific time range of a day or make your budget increase on a specific time range of a day they haven't given us the option on decreasing if you can also find the video on that and also i have shared one free google Luca studio template where you can upload and get the exact uh, audit report if i just show you the audit report let me just see if i can show you the audit report yeah here it should be so this is the audit report where we uh, showcased how you can get this data and just you can upload one report, advertising report and upload in the system that we have some shared with you for free and you will it will generate you this kind of report for you for completely free. Uh, so this report you can get for complete free all this. You just need to upload one report downloaded from Amazon and, up, and upload it here and it will generate a similar report, same exact report for you without you doing anything for free. So you can check out that video. Uh, the link will be also in the description. And also, if I just come back here, I have also written the conclusion. Uh, this uh, analysis was done by one of our PPC director, Afan. And here you can see uh, we are not utilizing broad and phrase properly in sponsored products. Yeah, that is what we shared earlier because exact match is taking a lot more percentage share. Same for sponsored brands as well. You can see sponsored brands. So we don't see so much sponsored brands campaign running on for them as well. Right. So uh, we are spending most in exact and it's giving us highest day cost among all ad types. Obviously, that will. Right. Optimization is required, as I've said, optimization is required at a much higher level in this account. And obviously, they are doing huge sales. And for that, a simple bit of optimization can bring their ad spend down or can focus their ad spend to a, a better better opportunity where they can scale more with a lesser A cost. So if there is opportunity, why not scale in that part, right? And why not push the budget where it is moving good instead of focusing on where it is not moving good? So this is about the report. I can sh uh, 
and uh, the last report that i showed the only data analysis it is available for india and us everywhere you can just uh, put your data on that and it will generate a similar report like that so that's it for the video and uh, make sure you comment below if you have any questions about this template uh, about anything just let us know we'll happy to answer your questions on the comment section thank you so much i'll see you again in next video